What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, we're going to be drawing Talking Tom. Let's get started at the top of our page at the bottom edge of the eyes. So we start on the left side. Starting from the outside of the eye, we're going to curve up in the middle. And then just pull that down on the inside. Let's leave a gap in the center and draw the same thing over on the right. So we're going to line this up. Starting on the right side, we're going to go up. And then bend that down. Now I'm going to go back to the left side and draw the top of the eye. Starting from the end, we draw a circle, going all the way around towards the top, round up the eye, come down, and then in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Starting from the inside of the eye, we're going to bring this up towards the same height, go out, and then down. Now we're going to push the iris and pupil towards the inside of the eye. So let's start on the left side, on the inside edge of the eye, we draw a circle, going around, down, and then in underneath the eyelid. Let's go over to the right and do the same thing. Going up, rounding this out, and coming in. And now I'm going to add a small circle on the top left for the highlight. So let's start up here, draw a small circle. We're going to line this up on the right and do the same thing. And now I'm going to draw an oval going in behind that highlight for the people. Let's start on the bottom of the highlight, come all the way down towards the bottom of the eye, go up to the top. And then pull this down in behind. And do the same thing on the right. Come down towards the bottom, go all the way up to the top, and then bend that down. Let's fill the pupils in black. Let's go back to the inside corner of the eyes. We're going to curve down and out towards the outside of the nose. Let's start with the left. We're going to come down and out, go to the right, and do the same thing. Now we're going to draw on the top of the nose. Let's start back on the left. We're going to curve up, and just pull that down in the middle. Go up, and then down on the right. Now we're going to go back to the left side. We're going to round up the end of the nose, come down, and then in towards the middle. Go up towards the right and round this out. Let's add the nostrils along the bottom. Starting on the left, we're going to curve in and then hook that back out. Line this up on the right and do the same. From the bottom tip of the nose, we're going to draw a straight line coming down towards the mouth. Now from here, I'm going to curve down and then up towards the left. Let's go down and bend that up. Go back to the center, curve down and then up towards the right. And then we'll add a bracket to the corners of the mouth on the left and right. Let's move out and draw the lower half of the head. From the outside corner of the eye, we're going to step out. We're going to bump out the cheek, going out. Now I'm just going to pull this in underneath the mouth, towards the chin. Going to round up the chin, go out towards the right, and then bend that back in. Now let's draw on the top of the head. Starting back on the left, we're going to go straight up. We're going to round up the top of the head. And then come down on the right side. Let's move up and draw on the eyebrows. We're going to start over on the left side. Curve up and in. Line this up on the right and do the same thing. Going out and then down. Let's round out the inside of the eyebrow. Starting on the left, we're just going to curl this back around, almost like a half circle. And we'll connect the top to the outside with a curve. I'm just going to taper this out and then down towards the point. Let's add the ears on the side of the head, directly above the left eye at the top of the head. We're going to start by going up and then down. Do the same thing on the right. Going up to the top of the head, and bend this up and then back down. Now let's curl up the tip of the ear. I'm going to bend this back up towards the top. And from the tip of the ear, we're going to curve in and then down. Round up the bottom of the ear and then pull that in towards the side of the head. Let's do the same thing on the right. Curve in and then down. And we'll just bend that back in towards the side. Now let's trace the ears along the inside. Starting from the bottom, we're going to step up. Just follow that same curve, going out and then up. And we'll come straight in and then bend that down. Let's do the same thing on the right. 
going all the way up towards the top and bending that in and then down. I'm also gonna add a couple stripes on the side of the cheeks. Let's start on the left side. I'm gonna curve up and then in underneath the eye and then we'll taper that back out and then down. Let's line this up on the right and do the same thing. Going up and bending that in and then we'll taper that out and then down. Now we're gonna leave a gap and add one more. Step down, curve up and just hook that in. Taper that back down towards the chin. Do the same thing on the right side. And then we'll add a couple whiskers on either side. From this point we're step in, draw a curve. One up and then out. And line this up on the right. And do the same thing. And then we'll step down and out and add one more. All right, now that we've completed the head, let's work our way down the body. We're gonna have the arms crossed in front of the body. So we're gonna start on the left side, underneath the head. We're gonna round up the arm, going out, and then down and in towards the elbow. And it's gonna pull this across towards the right. Curving across, and then up on the right. Now from here, we're gonna draw the top of the left forearm, going in, and then down. Now this is gonna blend into the right paw. So from here, it's gonna curl this back around, and then up. Let's add two more paws. We're going to step down, curve across, up, and then in. And then we'll add one more. At the top, we're going to go up, across the body, and then down in behind the forearm. Now we're going to find the center point underneath the arm. We're going to curve down, round up the arm, and then pull that up underneath the head. I want to add a small fold on the right side. So from this point, we're going to curve across, and then hook that down. Now we're going to move down and draw the side of the body. Underneath the left arm, curve out and down towards the hip. Go to the right and do the same thing. Now we're going to move towards the center and down and add a curve. From left to right, going up and then back down. Now we're going to leave a gap in the center, move over towards the left. We're going to curve the leg going out and then down towards the left heel. Move over towards the right, going out and down towards the right heel. Let's go back to the left heel. We're going to round up the bottom of the foot, curling up towards the first toe. So we're going to come down, up. I'm just going to hook this back around and in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Going down, up, rounding up the toe, and then hooking that in. And then we're going to layer two more toes in behind. Starting at the very top, we're going to draw almost like a C shape. Going out, and then in, and we'll do that one more time. Let's do the same thing over on the right. Going out, and then tucking that underneath, and doing that one more time. Now we're going to go back in between the last two toes. We're going to curve the foot going up, and then in. And the same thing on the right. And then going back up to the hip, we're going to round up the side of the leg. Let's start on the left side. We're going to curve out, down, and then in on top of the foot. Let's add the tail over on the left. Starting from the hip, we curve out and down, and then we'll just bend that back up. Let's round out the tip of the tail, almost like drawing a half circle, going back in. Now the tail is going to taper in behind the leg, so it gets narrower as we come in and then up. Let's add that white patch in the center of the body. Underneath the left arm, we curve down, almost like I'm drawing a half oval, and we'll tuck this in underneath the right arm. And that's pretty much it. There's Talking Tom. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.